From our Center for the Art studio, this is your AUTV 20 Sports Break. I'm Cade Krakus. Thanks for tuning in. Ashton University's men's basketball team will be headed into the offseason, losing more players than they expected. The Eagles graduated five players in Bo Furkron, Aaron Thompson, D Dylan Bogard, Derek Koch, and Josh Lavity. But after player meetings this past week, the Eagles will be losing four others. Freshman six-foot guard Brock Waits, sophomore six-four guard Hunter Sheddenhelm, sophomore six-one guard Trey Baumgartner, and sophomore six-three guard Dylan Fasiero have all notified Eagle head coach John Ellenwood that they are entering into the Division II transfer portal. The four transferring Eagles first notified the public by retweeting a tweet from at verbal commits D2 on Twitter. With the Eagles losing more players than expected this offseason, they'll be forced to dive deeper into their bench and the incoming freshmen next year to rebuild their program. On Saturday, March 19th, Ashland University's very own Trevor Bassett won his first indoor world silver medal. At the 2022 World Athletics Indoor Championship in Belgrade, Serbia, Bassett took second place in the men's 400 meter dash in 45.05 seconds a time which not only was a new PR by 0.22 seconds, but also broke his own NCAA Division II men's indoor record in the event. Bassett also became the 14th fastest man in collegiate history indoors in the event. On Tuesday, March 22nd, due to his outstanding performance at the Indoor Worlds, Bassett was named NCAA Division II men's track and field Athlete of the Week by the U.S. Track and Field and Cross Country Coaches Association. With his achievement of being named Athlete of the Week, that marks the seventh time he has done so. He now holds the record for the most times an Eagle has been named the Athlete of the Week. After the recent acquisition of Texans quarterback Deshaun Watson, the Cleveland Browns are now in a standstill while trying to trade away now backup quarterback Baker Mayfield. Originally, the Indianapolis Colts, Seattle Seahawks, Atlanta Falcons, and New Orleans Saints were rumored teams involved in the sweepstakes for Baker Mayfield. However, now the Colts have traded for Matt Ryan, the Falcons have signed Marcus Mariota, and the Saints have signed Jameis Winston, leaving only the Seattle Seahawks left as a team in need of a quarterback. Rumors around the league have speculated that these issues have occurred due to the size of Mayfield's contract and the asking price of the Cleveland Browns. The Browns are reported of asking teams for a high slotted draft pick, preferably a first or second rounder. Only time will tell where the once starting quarterback in face of Cleveland will end up. And that is it for this AUTV 20 sports break. Be sure to go follow us on all of our social medias at AUTV 20. I'm Cade Krakus. Thank you all for watching.